Aloha friends, good morning. Don't mind our morning face because we just woke up, brushed our teeth, didn't even have coffee. We went to Starbucks and um, just did a curbside pickup of our coffee just to go to Target. No returns, even though we did have returns, um, but just to get milk because Danica did not have milk last night. Oh, which one did you get? The Smash Oh, nice. We always share just a co one coffee and then one breakfast. But um, now on our way to Costco, we're trying to beat the after Christmas uh, shoppers. <laughs> but I picked up some really cute stuff at Target. Uh, they already have their Valentine's Day gift, so I'll add that onto um, this clip now. Target has some really nice uh, Valentine's Day stuff. We're here super early. They just open up. And oh. yeah, I wish that they were all red or all pink though. Uh, for my hot cocoa bombs. Oh, these are actually good for hot cocoa bombs. But they have these. And then they're just freshly displayed. But hubby. <laughs> we got the whole box of the um like the baby yoda because they're 2.99 and we have so many like um kids or loved ones to gift them to like 3.99 for this so for their valentine's day stuffings Advent calendar for Valentine's Day. And then um a oh, really nice one because it's like mandalorian stuff and then um decor stuff i was gonna pick up um if you guys are always wondering like where do i get my my stand for my sensi warmers i get them at the dollar spot over at target so they currently have red and white for valentine's day and they're the metal not the ceramic one and they're i think what three or five dollars so i did not pick any of those up because i i don't like the the size of it and I don't like it with like the the red hearts because then I'm um, limited to just the Valentine's Day so I like it like universal so I can use it throughout the year and now Costco to buy milk because we got her the cereal and this breakfast stuff in the in Target but milk eggs babe we have no eggs we have no eggs we have no eggs milk eggs and what else that's about it those are the essentials. Yeah, it's just the essential ones because we didn't have our usual weekly milk delivery man because um, we get them every Friday and then Friday was Christmas. So the other day was Friday, uh, Christmas. So i um, getting some extra milk and that's it. And then we're going to head home because hubby is saying that he can only Uber me for a little bit because uh, football is on. Yes, it is. <laughs> Who's playing today, babe? Santa's playing. 
Seahawks and versus who? Oh, the Rams. The Rams. Oh, nice. Yes. Hubby and his football on Sundays. All right, we'll see you guys in a bit. All right, we are now at Costco uh, getting more of the chia seeds. And then they have this organic matcha powder, Japanese green tea. We got some Richardson chicken, pineapple, and bacon. And then our favorite cheese. This is all on sale for $6 for two big tub lobster bits. This is $5. So Danielle makes this for the kids. Two of those. We just got regular milk because the organic milk is on sale because it has a expiration date that's expiring soon. Eggs and then quesadilla and hubby's nachos. Uh, cheese and this is $16.99 for these two big packets of taco. And then chicken nuggets is $8. It's on sale. <sighs> so far. <laughs> friends um this was a stop over at the dollar store with danielle but i don't think i showed it to you guys and they were just taking it out so i know it's new um, so i am loving gold um gold furniture like gold accents uh as far as like furniture like the furniture legs kind of thing and so these were at the dollar store a dollar so i grabbed two of these these are just like the little wire basket but i like how they're gold and then um, these are like the rectangle baskets. Okay, the round one, rectangle. And then I only grab this one of these, which is like for the paper. Because I didn't know how. Oh, you know what? I should have gotten for like the Keurig after Valentine's Day. You know, that'd be perfect for the Keurig. Maybe I'll stop at the dollar store again and see if they have it. Because it's been like maybe a week since... This was out and there was only a few of them and then over here um i grabbed this also gosh when the mall was closing <laughs> i actually um we actually asked them if we could just grab in really quick and the lady was nice enough because they were like closing within five minutes so i said i knew exactly what i wanted so i grabbed six of these because they are my favorite um hand soap during christmas time from uh, bath and body works mary cookie so i had six of them and plus i had others that i purchased through the online annual sale and then i gifted some of them away and so i wanted some for myself because danica and the girls love this oh it's so amazing and it's good for year round even though it has a gingerbread um, image to it it's just an amazing scent so i got four left over from gifting and then that's gonna be for us and then my chore today it's um sunday Two days after Christmas, yesterday was just all about family time on the opposite side of the water, uh, dropping off gifts and seeing the family with masks on. We didn't eat. We, it's just so hard. Um, so we spent a full day there of going houses to houses between aunts and uncles and, you know, parentals. And then um, this one I didn't, this is, these are not empty. These are boxes that I've already um showed you guys um i think except for the other one so i'll upload that tonight of another louis bag and then these are like the luggage tag so these were gifts for myself and then one was from hubby so i left it there so um just to put onto the tree and then my goal today is kind of fix this up turn it into a valentine's day i got a couple of stuff from target to be able to use so i'm going to take out the the warmers i want to i think i'm going to keep the trees up because it's still those are like winter trees not necessarily christmas trees so i'll keep those up i showed you guys this at target because we just came back from target um now tidying up but these are so cute these are the the joanna Gaines uh collection the hearth hearth and hand and it's 3.99 I love these for Danica because if you compare like the big ones for like the regular size mugs to these ones, it's um I believe this is a six, six ounce, but it's perfect for the little ones. And then it's perfect for me as well if I want to do like a, a hot cocoa because I don't like to fill this up with hot cocoa. And then when I do the hot cocoa bombs, it's a perfect size for them. So I grabbed two just in case one breaks for Danica, but... I really need to go through my mugs and the ones that we use because we use a lot of like these Starbucks collections. We collect these when wherever we go to places. But I kind of like these for the kids for like hot cocoa. It's not too big at all.
All right, making everybody lunch before I start making my last batches of hot cocoa bombs. So this one I have ham that I had um, chopped up, uh, leftover that I put into the freezer from Thanksgiving. And then I just put in some marinara sauce along with Alfredo sauce, salt and pepper, garlic. And then I went ahead and simmered that. Over here, I have some boiling noodles, and then I'm gonna put this, um, mix it into that sauce, and then put it into the oven. Okay, yeah. I like it al dente. Okay. Okay. Then I just mix it well. Then bake it into the oven with just some uh, cheese on top. And then <laughs> I saved Costco uh, peppers and Parmesan. So I'm just gonna add some Parmesan in here, Danielle's helping. So a couple of packets and then put it into the oven just for about 10, 15 minutes or so until it's nice and crispy. crispy. All right, friends, I have been cleaning up just a little bit uh, around the house of like all the mess that we did of like uh, wrapping and baking. My dining table has turned into like a baking um, station of all my uh, hot chocolate bombs. So putting that away, I am going to make a couple more though for the new year. I'm waiting for a mold, which is the Star Wars mold that the, for the boys, I think they'll really enjoy that one. Um, but I ordered it like a, I think a month ago and I'm still waiting on it. But I did change up the decorations onto this behind me, the wall behind me, which is just my little coffee bar section and then right in front of it. So let me go ahead and show you guys that. All right, this is the area that I shared onto my other channel of a Simply Simple scent because I do have a Scentsy warmer in here. So I'll add a, a little clip. I just turned it off because I'm heading upstairs to clean up upstairs. But I put a little bit of um, Valentine's Day decoration. These two have the same color almost. This one I got at Target today. And then I, um, I got that one at, uh, for Christmas from Hubby uh, as a surprise mini gift. And then also my pink gnome. I put it in here that was into my studio. And then for this one, I have two new warmers as well that I shared uh, over on that channel. And then I just move some stuff around of like the trees and then the wooden Christmas blocks. I like purchasing things during Christmas of like wood or white um, or like the pink one that I just showed you of the gnome because then I, I can extend it for the next um, season. I like the neutral. Sometimes the red especially if it's a Christmas red, it stays within that month or that uh, season. I can't move it onto like the Valentine's Day, even though Valentine's Day is red. So I try to get things also white to be able to add on to it. Um, now I can keep the gnome in here and then the wooden blocks that was for Christmas decor um, until February, okay? And then these trees can stay in here until uh, winter is over and for us winter doesn't end until about March <laughs> so really nice all right friends as always thank you guys for visiting a simply simple life mahalo